All right, I got some good news for anyone out there who's looking for a solution to recover deleted files. Um, if I go back a few months, um, I had reformatted the hard drive on one of my computers before we moved to our new house. Thinking that I had saved all my files on an external hard drive, for one reason or another, they did not save. Therefore, when I got to my new house, I had a computer that was like new, but I had no files on my external hard drive. I had lost everything. I'm talking about everything from from uh, home videos to to pictures, um, all my home business stuff, documents, everything that was on my computer was gone. And basically, I was in a whole lot of trouble. So I started a process of searching for something that would allow me to recover those files. Because what I found out was, even if you delete something off of your hard drive, um, the file's still there. And until um, there's other files installed on your computer to replace those files, they're still there, they're just hidden. And so I was trying to find something that I could use to recover everything back off my hard drive. And I downloaded a lot of these free tools. Um, you've probably done the same thing if you've been searching for a while, and they haven't done a thing for you. Trust me, I know what that's like. It's very frustrating, especially if there's very important um, things that you're trying to get back from your hard drive or memory card or whatever it is. Finally, I decided to buy a product. It was from a recommendation. Someone had uh, referred me to this product at SaveMyFiles.net. And so I went here and I downloaded it, and I want to show you exactly what this software does, and I think you're probably going to be pretty blown away too, because it should be able to recover your files too. And what's great about this, and I didn't realize this until after I downloaded it, installed it, and used it, but I can also recover files that are lost on um, my digital camera, my iPod, um, whether it's a flash drive, one of those little thin memory cards, um, the micro cards you can put in your digital cameras. It doesn't matter if it's a if if it's a device that has a memory card in it. Chances are you can recover the files that are lost on it, and this software will recover those files. And so, um, if you want to follow along with me, you can actually download this for free at SaveMyFiles.net, and you can download it for free and it'll scan any device you have whether it's a hard drive an external hard drive a memory card flash drive whatever it is it'll scan it for you and it will show you the files that it can recover but you will not be able to recover those files until you buy the product so that's what kinda got me but um, you know after using so many free products I finally decided to buy it and I was glad I did because really my only other option was to take my computer into a shop and have them to extract all the data for me, which would cost me well over a hundred dollars. And so um, I decided to just fork out. I think it was uh, thirty or forty dollars for the software, and it was able to recover all the files off my hard drive. I'm talking everything. So um, let me just go ahead and show you what it is. If you go to savemyfiles.net, you can download it here. You can read a little bit more about it, but it's a product called uh, uh, Data Recovery Pro, and it's by a company called Preto Logic. And I actually own several of their products, and I'm very, very happy with all of them. Um, and this is just another one that I'm really well satisfied with. So let me close this. Okay, here's the software and it has a lot of different options that can make it very easy for anyone to use whether you've ever used anything like this before or not it has a guided process that will just take you through step by step but this first tab here you see it says scan you can select to do a quick scan which um, basically what it does is, is it'll quickly scan your computer your hard drive and any attached uh, devices that you have to your computer and show you any files that, that can be easily recovered. Now, if you have a lot of files, um, or even if there's a file in particular that you need, you can type it in here and it'll find that specific file. If you want to do a deeper scan, you can do what they call a full scan, and it does um, a much deeper scan of your computer and all the connected drives. And then, and then there's also a guided scan, and this is really neat. If you click um, Start Scan, 
it gives you a few more options. It'll say, I want to recover items from my hard drive. And this is the option you use to recover any items from your hard drive. Um, even you, It even says here, even after the drive has been formatted. And that was my problem. And so um, I was able to do that. And of course, even if you delete them through the recycle bin and erase them, um, they're still there and they can still be recovered as long as you haven't installed a bunch of stuff on your computer and it may have overwritten those files. So the sooner you um, you try to recover those files, the better chances that they're still going to be there. Uh, the next option here is I want to recover lost emails. So even if you use Outlook or Outlook Express and if you um, reformatted your hard drive or just happened to lose it, it crashed or something, you can recover those. Uh, you can recover an item on an external hard drive or device. Um, use this option to recover files from devices connected to your computer, such as iPods and digital cameras. So if it has a memory device, you're going to be able to recover it. And if you click that, it's going to ask you, okay, which device do you want to scan? And it's going to give you the option of everything connected to your computer. And you can just click on whichever drive that is, click Start Scan, and it's going to scan it. So extremely easy to use. Click on Advanced. Um, this is just a really quick way to do a scan. If you're if you're a little bit more advanced and feel more comfortable using software yourself, um, it just asks you here. You know what areas do you want to scan? Your recycle bin, uh, maybe files without names. If you have corrupted hard drive sectors or reformatted partitions, it'll scan all that stuff, everything, to find those files that have been lost or deleted. And then you can choose what um, areas you want to have scanned. And um, we'll just do my C drive just to give you a quick example here. We'll do start scan. And it's going to scan for files that are recoverable. And if you look down here, you'll see that it's already found 300. Well, it's going to be up to 400 pretty quick. But if you look over here, it finds images, text files, HTML files, compressed files, folders, binary files, other files. Uh, it can basically recover any kind of file you have on your computer or any other device that you have attached to your computer that has some kind of a memory card. And then when you're done, um, I'm not going to let this run all the way through, but when you're done, um, I've already purchased this and I think yours will probably say register maybe. And if you click that button, it'll take you to the web page where you can... Um, where you can download it and purchase it. And I believe at the time I bought it, it was like $10 off. I got a coupon for it. And with Predo Logic, that, that's pretty common for them to offer those discounts. So hopefully, if you decide to buy it, it'll still be there for you too. Uh, but once you register it, they'll send you an email. The email came with uh, my license code. And I just go to About, and that's where I entered my license code at. Um, and they also had a phone number that I could call to activate it. And, you know, you can do it that way. Basically, they're just going to walk you through it and help you to activate it. And they're also going to try to sell you additional stuff. So, um, you know, it's, 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 it's a great company. It really is. And they have great products. But unless you don't want to have somebody trying to sell you a bunch of stuff, um, just take the license code from the email you get when you purchase it and just enter it in here. And you're going to be good to go because that's all you need to do, really. So that's just a quick overview. Um, and here's just a, a little tab here that's nothing just about just about emails in case um, you lost some emails or or formatted a hard drive or something and you need to recover those. It has a little tab specifically for emails to recover them. So overall, um, I just wanted you to know that if you have lost um, or deleted files, whether it's on your hard drive or any other external drive, they can be recovered and like I said the sooner you recover them the better the longer you wait the more likely those files are going to be permanently deleted and you'll never be able to get them back so uh, you can go to savemyfiles.net and you can download that like I said you can do a free scan of your hard drive or external devices to find out what it can recover before you purchase it so um, hopefully that'll help you out and and it'll do just as much for you as what it has for me